What's the deal? Yeah. Miami, here we come, baby. Being rocked with my daughters. Graduation, uh, face mask. Got my coffee right here. Flying so plain because of the cost of it. So, yeah. But we on we out of here in DTW. About to fly out. Day one. Day one. <laughs> Sorry, it's traveling day for us. So traveling with the crowd. That's right. So we almost out of here. Uh, boarding just started. We waiting. Even though it's cold here, we got a hoodie on. But when we get down to Miami, I'm putting on some shorts. Uh, I looked at it yesterday that it was 80, maybe 80 some degrees. So, yeah, we just waiting. I gotta figure out how to pair my headphones. It, 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 it's not pairing, it's not catching. I don't know what's going on. It's okay, he can listen to me sing. Whatever. <laughs> I ain't gonna happen. I'm about to go to sleep. And I just Whatever. ate two. There's some uh, Monica, some Heather uh, I just ate two and I'm sleepy. With Captain Mac at. Right, I'm just nervous. Right My dog, what's up, baby? What's up, man? How you been? What's up, man? How you, man? Ain't nothing to it, but the toys. <laughs> Nayshawn, Captain Mac, Captain Mac is Nayshawn. He runs this month. Hey, my pleasure, brother. Hey, uh, you late, man? Look here, partner. Don't worry about me being late. What I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna take this hoopie of yours up another thousand feet, catch me a slipstream, and we're gonna be there five minutes early. <sighs> You know, real slick like hair grease. Oh, but less mess. Can you dig it? Hell yeah, I can dig it. <laughs> you mean you really gonna do that? Nah, I'm just fucking with you. <laughs> ah, Y'all two know each other. <laughs> he was fucking with me. <laughs> Muggs, I'm really not playing right now. I'm not Muggs. Uh, I was looking at your resume, man. I see here that you flew in Desert Storm. That's pretty impressive. No, actually, homie, that's a typo. I drew off in Desert Storm. I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't even, what, what'd you say? I was a nigga that drew all the little sayings on the bombs. Fuck Iraq, Saddam, eat a dick. You know what I'm saying? That was me, secret agent. Matter of fact, I ain't even supposed to be talking about that right now. It's classified. What the fuck, Wait, Do you even know how to fly a plane, man? Trip, homie. I got my wings when I got out. Got your wings when you got out. You right, you know. Plus, I ain't really got another choice right now. How much? Nope. Uh -uh. Where's your uniform at, man? You looking at it. The macking is cracking. This is how I come. I don't wear no square suits. I'm a player. We ride spinners. We ride spinners. You ride spinners and you ride on bombs, you know, but that's classified. I'm gonna tell you what. Get us there safe. Can you do that? Yes, uh, you something else, Muggs? Drew on bombs. <laughs> Excuse me, man. Yes, sir. Hey, where the cockpit at? <laughs> you got that bomb? Whole bag. <clears throat> Testicles one, two. Testicles one, two. Hey, y'all, what's cracker like? This is your sole plane chauffeur, Captain Antoine Max speaking. It sounds nice. Welcome aboard NWA Flight 069 from the 310 to the 212. It's time to bust this corner, y'all. In a hot second, I'll be hitting them switches and getting this bitch pumping and jumping. So screw your shit on tight and enjoy the flight.
here. Miami, here we come. Right, sir. Of course I'm all right. I'm a G, ain't I? I, I will make the announcement. No, no, you won't. Give me this motherfucker. I'm making the announcement. I'm the captain. Ladies and gentlemen, we have reached our cruising altitude of 33,000 feet. 33,000 feet? Oh, shit, man. We fucking hired a red man at the Source Awards. Shit don't make no motherfucking sense to be this high, cuz. Man, I feel sick. Oh, fuck. Oh, Hey, this is shit. Wow. Hey. Hey. What the hell's going on here, y'all? Man, this nigga's afraid of heights. Well, how the hell are you gonna be afraid of heights and you the damn captain? I ain't never been off the ground before, man. We flew on computer simulators. Uh, that, that's, that's not what you told me, man. You told me that you got your wings when you got out the Air Force. No, I didn't, man. I told you I got my wings when I got out. When I got out of Pelican uh, Bay State Corrections Facility, oh it was either get a ship oh, or oh, take a pilot oh, class. You learn how to fly in the prison. Hey, man, don't get mad because I spent your money to get a good education. Shit, me and my homeboys passed oh the God. class with flying <laughs> colors. <laughs> Miss them niggas, man. Those are his niggas. The Taliban. Okay, you know, I'm going to tell you what. Y'all better fix it. Gay man? Uh, Captain Matt. It's Man. game on. I don't what give a damn. with you? I don't give a damn. I'm no bitch. bitch. You understand why? It's game on. Hey, nigga, oh, you gonna be a gay man. Fix it. Man, put this shit on autopilot. I'm gonna go to the lavatory.
we in Fort Lauderdale. Just getting on the plane. Um, it's a nice ride. Normally, y'all don't take a sleep, take a nap, but I took a nap on this particular trip. So, we actually um, going to get our luggage. You know, do you know where we gotta go get the luggage at? Huh? So we on our way to go get our luggage. Somewhere. In this beautiful airport. I wish it was like Vegas where you can get a stop at a booth and have a cigarette or something. <laughs> but it's a nice airport. Last time we was here, we came. Yeah, we was down here. We came down here deep. We had a whole charter bus. It was about 30 of us. Came down here, we had a bag of food. And we was over here clowning, having a good time. So, uh, I'll check y'all later. Are we gonna try to find where we pick up our baggage and what carousel? So, I'll talk to you later, because we gotta see if we can get an Uber or something take us to the, uh, our hotel that we have in Miami. So check y'all later. Peace. Good afternoon. We made it to our hotel room. And when we booked this room, it looked it different. Where, but when we booked it, um, it was looking beautiful when we booked it online. But it's something totally different from what we expected. I don't know if I should do a room tour. But I just don't it's know. Just it's just for one night. So, right. Better than the cockroach that we had was in. We, we did another hotel. We was in Miami. And we did the Carnival Splendor cessation. And it was just <coughs> crazy, y'all. So, again... But here go the room tour. <laughs> this oh, is the table. Yeah, I'm about that. This is the refrigerator, <laughs> phone, <laughs> desk, slot. That's a good thing that the TV is up here. So if you oh, yeah. want to flick it, you know. Yeah, I don't know what to say. 
to go to bed. She's sitting on it. Our bag's over there. Lights. Um, another light over there. This is at the Harrison um, in Miami on the other side of the port. Because when we were coming in today, we actually seen the Symphony of the Seas at port. We seen the Symphony of the Seas at port. We seen the kind of a Freedom at port. We seen the kind of a Sunrise at port and some other ship at port when we was coming in. So basically, it's something different. Because normally we stay in Fort Lauderdale. It's a hotel in Fort Lauderdale. Every time we do a cruise in Miami, we stay there. So, well, besides this one and another time we was in Miami. But, anywho, go back to what I was doing. Door right there. <laughs> AC on the raw. i never seen that before. Missing a smoke detector, but it is what it is. Bathroom look good. Tissue. I had to go downstairs and get dry out towels. I mean, the sink bowl look good. The shower look good. You know what I'm saying? It's a glass shower. Nice. You know, you can hear the fan going off in the bathroom. You know, I don't know what's going on. It look like water damage, but I got it on booking.com. And I sure will write a review on this particular hotel, but this light over here does not work. Why? I don't know. Excuse me. So it's another thing, but for the price, it is what it is. We came in, you know, we had a long flight, um, the Soul Plane. But it was a good flight, can't complain. I actually normally don't take a, take a nap. I took a nap and it was okay. You know, he actually, we got here early than what we expected. He was speeding. Cause as soon as we got on the plane, he pulled back and that's when I know we was taxiing. We took off. So we got here um, um, really, really fast. Like when we got down to uh, Fort Lauderdale, we normally fly through Fort Lauderdale. It was scorching hot. Oh, I found some lizards. You know, this little thing, he was just running around. I tried to find it, but I got I took a picture while he was looking at me, but I'm going to put that up there, too. But we trying to go, trying to just sit back for a minute. We just going to chill out, probably find somewhere to eat, and then probably call it a day, you know. Really don't got too much going on today. Um, you know, this, this particular part, the other side of Miami, I never been here before, so... I mean, I would, I should have, I should have changed the booking when I saw another hotel was like <coughs> up the street around the corner from the port. But like I said, I was trying to do something different, stay on the other side of Miami just to see what it is. But like I said, when we was, when we was doing some research, research on here, where it's a couple of restaurants, it's like a CVS up the street around the corner where um, we have to go and get. Um, so we'll be doing that today too. So we don't gotta do that tomorrow. And et cetera. So um that's about it for our the room tour. It's a small room. It'll do. The bed is a little bit comfortable, but it, you know, it'll do. You know, I'm just had a guy that, you know, um <laughs> huh? We will survive the night, but, you know, just pray to God that hey, we'll be all right, you know, and be a set. But like I said, we found a couple places down the street from where we at. Um, it's like a burger place. It was another place that we was a couple of days ago. I was looking around to see what else was around here to do. Then it's a beach up the street, but <laughs> ah. <laughs> I don't know, you know, but uh, more to more to come on our adventure of the carnivore horizon we'll be boarding tomorrow um i can't wait to get on because our last cruise we did was in february of what 19. no we didn't do the mardi gras the, we was in new orleans yeah well, anyway, we was in New Orleans when the pandemic was coming down. That was the last time. Not the ship. Not the ship. 
But that was the last time we since we've been on board on the partnership where um, just a month ago we were supposed to do the kind of a Vista and a week before we were supposed to sell out, you know, kind of kind of gave us a hard time because me, myself and my wife, my oldest child were at vaccinated, but my youngest child's not vaccinated. So basically they were saying we could come get on the ship but i'm like i'm not gonna leave my daughter here by herself so we end up canceling that one love by grace of god carnival gave us our full refund thank you for that i appreciate it um with no penalties where you know i was expecting i wanted to go down to the port of galveston because i never been there and plus like i said i have family down in uh, houston no san antonio where we were going to spend a couple of days with him and then head to the port. But um, more to come on our glorious adventure here on the other side of Miami, um, where a different atmosphere here. So more to come to it. So I'll check y'all later.